this is the fuel measuring it goes down the tank okay so I got it out this piece and uh, there should be some floating thing I guess here can't see that can you see rust in the inside yeah anyway I try to measure this one by doing this I don't know if it's that way but I unhooked it here and then I measured the, the resistance in ohm but I couldn't get any any sensing so I believe this is toast and I need to buy one there's the fuel fuel outlet got some kind of filter there So, when I measure these two, left and the middle, middle one, and I put it in like this, I get a reading about 16, 16 kilo ohm, 16 kilo ohm. And when I pull it like this, I get about 35 ohms only, not kilo ohms, 35 ohms. So this is working, but the floating stuff isn't there. And it feels a bit, uh, should run lighter, I believe. Okay, so we're there. And what do we have? It's 50 ohm, something like that. Very low. Right? And let's see if I can make... I turn this one, well, you, well maybe you see it, so it's in that direction now, and let it stabilize, and what do we get? It's kilo ohm, or it's 600 ohm, 500, now it's mega ohm, you see? so. It's much higher. So it seems to be working, but uh, if I measure on this one, I do I have contact? Maybe I seem to always get this one, no matter how I turn this one, it's still the same. So I have connected a battery again and I put this on a half or something like that and uh, I turn on the ignition and voila we get some reading there. So if I move this one let's see if we get some change. It goes down. And if I pull it all the way to the other side, we get a full tank. So, the bulb that's lifting it up is missing. And I've checked around, but I can't find it either. Maybe it's still in there, or they have emptied it out. Emptied it out. So time to measure the level. I put it like it's in a full uh, full tank. You know it floats up. This one you can move, you know. And uh, I've connected the, the one wire to the blue white, and the other one to the green outlet. You can see I've just connected a couple of cables here. And then connected them to the multimeter to get a good connection. And um, you can see here it fluctuates some. The resistance is not so stable, but it's uh, it's going down now. Yeah, 
But uh, as you can see, we have this reading. If I push this, as in it, it gets more empty. Let's see what we get. Take some time. <laughs> it's not stable. Hmm. Am I out of reach? Yeah, maybe. Here we get 91 kilo ohm. 91 kilo ohm. 100 kilo ohm. It's almost like empty. And then I pull it again back. This is middle way or something. 14K, 12K, something like that. And then empty. It's a smaller resistance, like 1K, 1 kilo ohm. So that's a way to test your, it should go light move easily of course since it will float so now we're up to over 200 100k yeah well that's the reading i'm gonna replace this one now it has lost its floating ball or the previous owner have, have lost it i believe or it's still in the tank but it doesn't have it and it doesn't work, so I will replace it with the one I just tried. And I don't even know what I've been fighting for Every time I fall in the deep And I can't fight it, I can't fight it You wreck my mind, I'm losing my sleep And you know that it's all that I need So don't leave me Just pull it here and we'll connect this together and then we'll try it out. So will it work? We got empty now and uh, let's turn the keys. Voila! Almost full tank. Yeah, nice. It's working. One less error on this bike. You can follow. I've done a lot of. I've done a series of uh, fixing this up. This Baosian uh, BTM. Check out my other videos if you're interested. Just turn it off there. It goes down. This is the old one. It is really it doesn't move well. It's hard to move. Looks bad. Maybe I just can loosen this up here and it will work, but no, this looks really bad. Okay, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Bye bye. So I remove this little clip on the other side here. And then you can pull this out. And you see the small fingers focus. There is a Rubbing against this small resistance. Hmm.